Hi everybody, my name is David and this is the Cartoon Fortress YouTube channel and as always I'm very happy to be here with you today and accompanying me on today's video is a fresh reprint here from Fright Rags. This is a reprint of a very popular, um, obviously Texas Chainsaw Massacre uh, t-shirt that they had earlier and they just did a reprint on this and a few other shirts. I'll be featuring another shirt in a um, in a video uh, very soon uh, to when this one publishes. Uh, so you'll have to wait and see what that one is. But i uh, very happy to get my hands on this. I love Fright Rags and I, I wanna say I'm in no way sponsored by them. I just really like to promote brands that I love and Fright Rags I, does re produces really great t-shirts and um, I know they have other products on there as well like hats and hoodies and things like that. Um, but I'm definitely a t-shirt guy and they really um, meet the demand in terms of just really high quality shirts and I love their blend as well because it's a cotton poly blend as opposed to a hundred percent cotton blend which just never works well for me. I, I'm always shrinking those shirts so these always keep form um, a lot better than uh, other shirts that I've tried out even from other uh, horror film t-shirt brands, um, Fright Rags seems to be the best um, that I have found. So, uh, yeah, very excited to have this shirt. And if you haven't had a chance to go to their site, I definitely recommend going and checking them out. They've always got uh, great new designs coming in. They have a lot of great collections. So, anyways, <laughs> but that is not the focus of this video. The focus of this video is the Vinegar Syndrome Halfway to Black Friday sale and I picked up a few titles now not all of these titles in fact I don't uh, maybe one or two of these was actually on sale um, and then uh, one of these was uh, became available upon the start of the Halfway to Black Friday sale I'm not very well versed in Vinegar Syndrome at all. I've just got a few of their titles in my collection, so I don't know exactly how all of their cells and the inner workings of, of Vinegar Syndrome operate, but I have four titles here that I am very excited about. So we'll go ahead and uh, go through these. Now, uh, two of these are Vinegar Syndrome proper, and then uh, two of them are from partner label Utopia. Uh, who I'm really starting to get into. They've got some uh, some great titles. Uh, one of which I have featured, I think it's just one, looking over at my shelf here. Um, yeah, Martha, A Picture Story. Yeah, that's the only uh, Utopia title that I have in the collection, so I'll be adding two of those. Uh, the first one, and, and these are both blind buys, I have not seen these films. Uh, the first one is called Minor Premise, and this is a film by Eric Schultz. And as always with uh, titles featured on the Vinegar Syndrome site, as well as their partner labels, um, they have really great slip covers, just really great overall design. So as you can see here, um, really, really cool, uh, kind of disturbing looking cover here. And uh, we get the embossed uh, titling here on the spine. And then there's the, uh, the other side, which is a different color, kind of a red there, also embossed. And then here is uh, the back of the slip cover. Um, so this is, let me get you some stats on the back here, some specs. Uh, so this is a film from 2020. So obviously a very new film. Uh, comes in at a runtime of 95 minutes. Um, I checked out the trailer uh, just directly on the Vinegar Syndrome site and I was really intrigued by this. It kind of, um, it kind of had a little bit of the, kind of gave me a little bit of primer vibes just in terms of the trailer. Um, so I'm, I'm excited to check this out and um, with minor, uh, with minor premise, the, the genre does seem to be a little bit sci-fi, maybe a little bit drama. Um, but it looked kind of just 
obscure enough. Like it doesn't look like it's going to be a, you know, super high budget film, which for me is actually always going to be a plus to be quite honest with you. Um, so not a huge budget here, um, which also I guess kind of is, is one of the reasons it gives me primer vibes. But anyways, uh, really excited about this. Sorry, I'm blabbing on here. So <laughs> uh, especially for a film I don't know anything about. Um, so we'll go ahead and move on, but uh, minor premise, and we will get all these titles unboxed here in a minute, so you'll be able to see the whole package here, but I'm um, excited about that. Uh, next up, we have, again, from Utopia, uh, we have Creststone. Um, now, this is a really intriguing premise, um, one that I... Uh, again, a trailer that I watched directly on the Vinegar Syndrome site, and it's basically um, a world of... Now, what service is it that they... Yeah, SoundCloud. It's basically a group of SoundCloud rappers that uh, basically live out in the desert, and they just kind of survive off of... Maybe they survive off of the land, and they just kind of... Um, live in isolation and they do their uh, their SoundCloud rapping and that type of thing and and it's it's kind of um, living on the the edges of society if you will um, and looks really intriguing very much a uh, kind of a human piece uh, kind of an exploration of a, a different side of humanity or maybe diff just a different kind of lifestyle which is one of the reasons I honestly love film is is just exploring uh, kind of different ways of thinking, um, living, just kind of operating throughout life, and um, was really intrigued by the trailer on this. Now the the year of release also twenty twenty, so we have two really new uh, really new films here, and I I think this is more in the uh, the lines of a documentary. Um, and this is just a runtime of 73 minutes and uh, just really intrigued by uh, by this film and I love as, I, as I've said many times on this channel I love documentaries and that that kind of style of filmmaking um, so there's the cover and the back on that no embossing or anything like that on on the title or anything like that but um, there's Creststone, uh, so two films from 2020. Now we we definitely jump back here um, away from 2020, and uh, so these uh, these uh, last two are Vinegar Syndrome titles. Um, first up, I've had my eye on this one for a little while now. They still had a bunch of copies available, so I don't know if this one just isn't selling that well, or um, you know what what the case might be. But either way, I'm really excited about this. I, I watched the trailer and it looks uh, really, really goofy. Um, you know, kind of a good title for a bad movie night, um, which I'm always up for. Anyways, uh, this is Death Promise. And this is a cool slipcover. I don't know if we can get this to show here. There's actually some spot glossing on the... Uh, the slip cover here and then the background there you get kind of the shimmer on there and then the background is more matte um, but just really really fun art here on the cover and then on the back here it says filthy rich landlords get away with murder it's time they pay for it you have a nice little picture of a rat here with some blood droplets and then you get the nice embossed um, title on the spine there, and then on the other side as well. Um, so this side doesn't feature the Vinegar Syndrome logo, but this one does. Whoops, on that side there it is. Um, so this title is from, like I said, we're jumping back away from 2020 here. This is from 1977. Uh, with a runtime of 95 minutes. Um, the first two titles that I showed you from Utopia are Region A Locked. Um, this is actually a region free title, um, so that's something to be aware of. I know I've got viewers that are 
uh, that are international, and I do a lot of importing of titles into my collection. So I always like to mention um, the uh, region coding on uh, the discs that I feature on this channel. So uh, region free, and then the Utopia titles are region A. Okay, so we'll take a deeper look at this in a second. And last up, uh, I'm sure this is one of their biggest sellers for the Halfway to Black Friday sale. Uh, this is the second title in their Vinegar Syndrome Ultra line. Um, the first uh, being Beastmaster, um, which I've got over there on the shelf. Um, this is Six String Samurai. Um, another one that I'm really intrigued by, I've watched the trailer and a few clips, and uh, this looks like another great candidate for a uh, bad movie night, like so bad it's good type, type movie night. And honestly, that's one thing I like about shopping uh, for the titles that I, that I do pick up on Vinegar Syndrome. A lot of them kind of fit that category. And, and I want to be clear that that's not a bad movie night is not a negative thing in my mind. I love watching some of these um, you know, shoestring budget, you know, type films where they're just the right amount of goofy and kind of unbelievable that it's, uh, that it makes for a really fun movie night. And, and a lot of times I like to, well, I should say most, most movie nights for me, I am just watching solo, but, uh, these types of titles are really fun to watch, uh, with a group. And I think this, from what I can tell, this would be uh, one of those titles. This, this would be fun to watch with a group of people. But anyways, um, we have Six String Samurai. You can see the commissioned artwork on here. I almost feel like the cover is maybe a little bit too busy. Um, a little bit, uh, you know, maybe it could feature a little bit more of a range on the tones and colors that they're using. But um, at any rate, it, it is an interesting cover for sure. And I love this uh, design. This is the magnetic closing case that uh, Vinegar Syndrome designed. And really, I mean, overall here, I'm not, I'm not complaining about the design, just trying to maybe point out a, a criticism or two, but um, then you have the kind of the wraparound style art. There's the spine on there, um, but we'll definitely dive into this here in just a second. So those are the four titles uh, that I picked up from the Halfway to Black Friday sale. There's still uh, other titles that I that I didn't pick up uh, during the sale that I that I would like to um, uh, to purchase soon. One of them is the televised terror. And I believe that's a volume one set, if I remember right. Um, but I'm really intrigued by the titles. Uh, so that's a three film collection. And um, you get a young Elijah Wood, you get one of the kind of landmark um, made for TV horror movie titles in there. And then you get uh, the calendar girl murders. Um, anyways, uh, really looking forward to that one. And then there's, there's a few others that I'd like to pick up, uh, probably sooner rather than later and add to the collection. But this is what I picked up for the sale. So what I'd like to do now, as we always do is jump to the other camera so that we can get these sets unboxed so that you can make uh, the judgment call and, and see if maybe these are something that you would like to pick up. Um, now, all of these that I'm featuring in this video are still currently in stock, so meaning the slipcovers are in stock at time of filming this video. So that, of course, can change it at any time. Um, but if you're into slipcovers, uh, you know, really fun slipcovers and that type of thing, then um, these are, you know, definitely up your alley in terms of just product design. Obviously, the film is you know, the most important thing if you're interested in the, in the film. And then uh, six, string, six String Samurai, obviously, with the outer box and all of that. Um, I know at this point Beastmaster is out of print in terms of the, um, you know, kind of the outer magnetic box uh, design, but they are releasing a slipcover edi edition of that, and I think that's on pre-order right now. 
Um, yeah, so just, just FYI on that, if you're still interested in Beastmaster and don't wanna pay the aftermarket, you know, eBay, whatever prices, um, there will be a, a slipcover edition of that coming out soon. So let's go ahead and jump to the other camera and get these sets unboxed. Okay, here we have our stack of uh, titles from the Vinegar Syndrome Halfway to Black Friday sale. So let's go ahead and jump into these. So as you can see, we have our four titles here. Let's start uh, with Minor Premise. So here you can see we have some really great, uh, very effective cover art here. And then our spine. There is the back. And then we get the different color titling on the spine here to match kind of the color scheme there. And then, you know, these kind of match here. So that's really, really neat uh, design there. All right, and then let's set our slip cover to the side there. And then we get same artwork here. Let's go ahead and pull the plastic off here and then we can give you a look at the uh, contents of the disc here on the back. All right. Yeah, so same cover art there. Let's flip over to the back here and give you an opportunity to read the synopsis and the bonus features. And you can see here we do have a Region A title. All right, and then on the inside, um, so we do get some uh, reversible cover art actually, which is awesome. That matches the, obviously the slip cover art. I always love to flip over to the reversible art. Um, so you kind of get the best of both worlds. Um, whoops, adjust that a little bit. Um, All right, so there is the reversible cover art. And then the titling there, and then obviously the same info on the back. Um, so really cool package here with a really stellar, um, nice thick slip cover that they, that they produce. So that is minor premise. Next up we have Creststone, also from Utopia. So there's the cover, the spine, and then the back, other side. All right, let's again pull the plastic off here to give you a better view of what we've got here. All right, so this cover art does differ from the slip cover. So I don't know if we'll have reversible cover art in addition to this or not, but there's that. And then there's a look at the synopsis and bonus features. So both these titles aren't super heavy on the bonus features, but it's great to see something, something included here. And then we have a region A title as well. All right, so no, um, no reversible cover art, but we do get some inner artwork. So that does match the cover of the Blu-ray. And then there is uh, the inner artwork here as it exists here behind the disc. Okay, so that is Creststone. Next up we have Death Promise. Again, just really, really stellar artwork here on the slip cover that I, I just absolutely love. And the artwork on the back, just the nice embossed uh, titling here on the spine, and then the Vinegar Syndrome logo there on the bottom. All right, pull the plastic off here and I'll be interested to see 
if we do get reversible artwork on here, maybe an original poster or something like that, I'm not sure if we will or not. Again, I'm not super familiar with uh, Vinegar Syndrome and how often they offer that type of thing, but um, yeah, it does look like we do get reversible art and really cool reversible art actually. All right, so there's the disc art. And let's go ahead and flip the artwork here. All right, so definitely a cool uh, <laughs> cool design there. And then you get the yellow spine and then here is uh, the synopsis and special features. And a region free title here. So that is Death Promise. Really, really excited to watch this one. I'm excited to watch all of these, but this just looks like a lot of, a lot of fun. All right, and then last up, we have our uh, Vinegar Syndrome Ultra title here of Six String Samurai. All right, so yeah, you have the little tab here, and that's kind of a magnetic latch. Not a lot of give here on, on opening this. I don't remember if Beastmaster was quite as rigid in terms of opening this, but anyways, I, Really cool. Let's let's explore the outside artwork actually here for for a second. Jumping in a little bit too quickly there. There's actually it's going to be hard to see on here, but there actually is spot glossing on the the uh, font here on the side, which is really cool. I know that's really not coming across on camera. And there's the back. I do love a good desert uh, location for uh, in 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 a film. So that immediately piques my interest. Um, yeah, so there's the, and I love how fully kind of enveloping the, the artwork is throughout the set. There's really no wasted space in that regard. And then let's pull this away there. So there's the artwork. Let's go ahead and set that aside. And then we'll set the booklet aside. So then, here we have the, the film on the inside, which has its own slipcover. So really, again, just stellar design and packaging all throughout. Um, so there's the cover. So no, uh, no film title to speak of anywhere on the, the slipcover at all. But again, I love how this art wraps all the way around for kind of one complete image. All we get is the vinegar syndrome. Um, and then you can see this is VSU.02. Really excited to see what the their third edition will be within the vinegar syndrome ultra line. All right, so remove the slip cover. And then here, and yeah, so this is a 4K um, ultra HD release. Um, let's go ahead and pull out the trusty pocket knife here. Now I don't know, I think it should include a Blu-ray disc as well. Um, I think it is a dual format release, but I could be wrong. And I'm getting myself in a mess here. All right, let's see how long it takes me to unwrap this. Okay. All right, so there you go. There is the synopsis and special features. So, yeah, so it looks like we do get uh, Blu-ray on the inside as well. And this is a region-free title. Of course, 4K is natively... Um, 
region free. Yeah, so we do get a Blu-ray and a 4K disc here. So there's the Blu-ray disc. And our 4K disc as well. So again, just really wonderful artwork all throughout. All right, so put this back in its uh, slip cover and that is not all we have here. We have one last piece to look at here and that is the uh, perfect bound book here for Six String Samurai. Give you a peek on the inside here. So this is an essays and photo book. All right, we have a director's statement. Um, so nice thick pages here, actually. Uh, great paper stock used in here. Great photos, a lot to read in here. Flip through quickly here to the end. So I'm really intrigued by this film. It seems like um, it's one of those that is uh, may maybe a bit ambitious outside of its out of, out of its depth a little bit. Um, but I'm really intrigued to see what they what what was produced and and uh, you know how they utilized their smaller budget that type of thing. So. Um, let's go ahead and put this all back together here in our nice uh, box here. All right, so there's the book and of course the film. Kind of try and keep that tab on the inside there to have a cleaner outside here. But uh, really, really great release here from Vinegar Syndrome for their uh, second Vinegar Syndrome Ultra title with Six String Samurai. And of course we have Death Promise and then Crest Stone and Minor Premise, both from Utopia. Um, so a, a pretty small haul here, but uh, very excited about all of these titles from Vinegar Syndrome and Utopia. All right, everybody, thank you so much for joining me on the video today. Let me know down in the comments below if you were able to pick up any titles for the Halfway to Black Friday sale. Let me know if there's any titles that you would highly recommend from the collection. Like I said, I'm not very well versed in uh, Vinegar Syndrome or a lot of the titles that they have to offer. And um, if you have a recommendation, uh, drop it down in the comments. And again, let me know uh, what you were able to pick up during the sale and uh, we'll continue the conversation down below. If you are interested in this type of content, uh, film and film collecting, unboxing videos, that type of thing, I invite you to hit the subscribe button, also the like button, and finally the bell icon. That will of course notify you when I upload new videos in the future. And until next time, my name is David, and you have an awesome day.